What is up guys, Pro Interceptor here, and I'm bringing you guys a new video for my Indie Game Saturday. Sorry that this is late, but I was working double shifts the past couple days, and this whole week has just been slammed with work, and been super, super busy. So, let's get started with this. Let's go to New Game, and see Tutorial, your goal, hire more workers, produce shirts for you, upgrade your equipment to earn more, make money by... Okay. Let's get started with this desk. Oh, worker. Okay, okay. Um. So now what am I doing? I, I honestly have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Alright, desk. Can I hire workers? No? Okay. Oh, I don't have enough money, that's why. Gotcha, gotcha, okay. Man, there's a lot of stuff. Upgrade hall. Oh, crap. Um, let's see, resets. Reset multiplier. Uh, wait. Nope. No, 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 no. Damn, damn, damn. No, no. There we go. Hee <laughs> hee. Alright, so what's this? Plus two upgrade hall. Alright, so after you reset, then you get plus two or something? Hmm. Huh. Okay, okay. Starting to get some more money. Noise, noise. Top 10 fetching, fetching, fetching. Okay, okay. Sounds good. Now, just gonna have to wait. Wait. Nope, can't take that. Uh, how many, uh. Alright, now I'm able to have a bunch. But I need a little bit more money so I can. Uh, hire another worker. All right, but yeah, this is a uh, sweatshop. It's a indie game, and I just thought that this seemed interesting to try out. And I don't know, it's it kind of reminded me of like the like game for mobile devices, like Adventure, uh, Capitalist, or whatever it is. And basically, it's like, oh yeah, you have to start off by doing a lot, but then it kind of just like automates itself come on come on there we go okay so we can hire another worker and they'll both be producing now sweet so let's see walkers you get the walkers and they'll take the stuff up I guess maybe possibly hmm Platform, sewing machines, workers, and after you get like a sewing machine, they'll probably be producing much more. I'm guessing. That's just purely by thought. And let's see, each worker and desk upgrade costs more. Alright, alright. So still kind of just clicking, whatever. Come on. There we go. We got the mouse. So we have upgrade or a bonus. Come on, aw, oh, damn it, we're off. <laughs> um, hmm, I'm trying to figure out how much more I need before I can get. Let's get this. Wait, get desk here. All right, so it's twenty left. I need. 24 before I can get another worker. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Got a nice bonus. Come on. 36. Very good, very good. Come on, make another shirt. Come on. Damn. Okay. Uh, let's just go ahead and put a worker here. Now we're getting like three things three shirts yeah that's what we're making shirts try to remember the tutorial but it was all just worded together no spaces at all so let's collect from there and there and there so we need 50 before we can get a platform which I have no idea what it does at all upgrade a hull I'm no idea what that is huh 
error. Oh, I need the money before I upgrade it. Yay. Resets. There we go. All right, we're getting close. All right, there we go. You can buy a platform now. All right, uh, let's go with this first one. Buy a platform. No idea what it does. I'm guessing I can do better materials making shirts last longer or something. Or you put a sewing machine on it, possibly. I don't know. I honestly, <laughs> no idea. But we're producing a decent amount right now. There we go, there we go. Especially with the mice running around or rats or whatever the hell they are. <laughs> Alright, let's get another desk and a worker. So we can start making some more money. Hey, we got an achievement. A team. Very nice. Hey, I'm a lot of clicking right now. Till I guess I can earn up the money to get a walker. Then it's just the walk around and automatically do it, I guess. I don't know. Hmm. I'm still trying to figure out what that platform's for. Cost me 50 bucks for it. Or 50 money. I don't know what the system is in here. Uh, come on. There we go. Getting some nice products rolling out. It's weird, though, that the only thing that changes with the workers are their outfits. Except for these. These two are exactly the same. Huh. Weird. Alright. Clicking that. Come on. There we go. Again, a few nice bonuses. Alright, that's it. Alright, so 78. I need 200 for the next material. Yeah. Mm, let's put another desk, another worker, collect more. I seriously have no idea what that platform's for, it's irritating the hell out of me. And it also sucks that this is a complete, like, clicking game. But, besides that, I kind of like the concept that they're doing. Like, just one of these, I don't know, upgrading type games they can play for... Well, after you get the automatic stuff, it, you're able to play for like a while. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Click. There we go. We be making some money now. Be rolling in that monies. Come on. Alright. 117. We need 200. Jeez. It probably ups the value of the materials or something. Of the shirts. I'm guessing. I truly have no idea since I just started this when the recording started. Do do do. Doop. All right, there we go. There we go. Get some of that nice money rolling in. Click, click, click. Boop, click. Boom, boom, boom. Look. All right. Uh, hmm. Be worth putting in another one. Yeah. Why not? Get six people making shirts. Oh yeah. Be doing as good as. I don't know. Cause no one sells shirts for a buck. Come on. There we go. Yeah. No one sells shirts for bucks. This is more like. McDonald's type things like you know a lot of people work in and high demand and selling stuff for a dollar all it is it's supposed to be all about supply and demand 
Now, after I get the material, then I can get a sewing machine, making shirts much faster, I'm guessing, instead of hand making them. Makes sense. But I'm going to get the materials first for that person. So I can see what it's all about. Alright, 189. We're getting much, much closer, guys. There we go, there we go. Yeah, no idea what that did. Yeah, I truly have no idea what the materials are for. It's not making them faster. Or is it? I actually think it might be making shirts faster. Not increasing the price of them, but just faster. Huh. Interesting. You know what? Let's uh, give you a platform. Yeah, see? He's making the shirts much, much faster. Huh. Interesting. Well, now we're finding out what some of the stuff does. <laughs> we still need a lot more people, though. Yeah, I just now realized he's like has his feet propped up and all that. So I can lay him back, just like oh yeah, I'm I'm just gonna be the supervisor and just lay back and do absolutely nothing except for sleeping while people are working. I seriously need to get the walker because otherwise this is gonna be taking forever. <laughs> so much clicking. Come on, click the damn fucking mouse. There we go. Making decent amount of money. There we go, there we go. 175, not too shabby. I do say so myself. Alright, let's click, click. Hmm. What else is there after a walker? Just like... I don't know, probably more supplies, or like material upgrade or something, I don't know. Error, okay, so I'm not able to do that, walker. WSRS, no idea what that means. No idea. What I do know is that I need to get him a stack of materials ASAP, so we can start making some more products faster. Like, how he's making them. Pretty sure he's making them faster. Now that, like I said, that's just my observation. Come on. I love how the shirts are also just square, or I mean not squares, rectangles. There we go. Getting some more workers here in our sweatshop. The concept of this game is just awful. Hiring people to work at a sweatshop. It's just so mean and cruel. But yet, that's how like most of our products that we buy are made. So awful to think about. But yet, no one ever does anything about them because... You know, sp so many billions, what, 7 billion? Yeah, 7 billion people now, and no one complains because we need all, well, not need, but demand so much, like, product-wise, that it's the only way that things are really made anymore. It's either through sweatshops or, like, really bulk manufacturing, and the products are just outrageously priced. <sighs> just awful. 
But yeah, if it wasn't for that, pretty much none of this stuff would be possible. Like, this game wouldn't be possible to be played right now. Guys wouldn't be watching this video right now. And price of everything would just be skyrocketing. Put another desk and worker. Give him a platform. Come on. There we go. I got the damn mouse. Clicking the mouse with the mouse. Or wait, no. Yeah, clicking on the mouse with my mouse. There we go. Got it. I have no idea what the platform's for. Like, does it increase productivity? Or what? Hmm. Alright. Hmm, let's see if we can get a stack of stuff made. He's at two. Two. Two, two. Two, 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 three, three. Huh. I think he's at... I don't know how many he's at. Alright, I'm just going to let that mouse run around for right now. And... Come on. Oh, what? I totally got him. That's bull. Some straight up bull crap. Max. Five out of ten, what? So these people can only have... What, four or five? What the hell? <laughs> Come on, click the damn mouse. There we go. Alright, nope, nope, nope. Yep, there we go. This music's weird. It's like old time stuff, I don't know. <laughs> Give him materials. And give you a platform. Platform, there we go. Just clicking away at our sweatshop here. So we've been playing for a thousand and seventy three seconds. Dang! <laughs> We still have zero walkers. How dare we? Sewing machine. Come on. We need a sewing machine already. Make even more. Eh. Come on. There we go. Clicking all over the place. Collecting these shirts that my lovely sweatshop workers are making for three cents an hour. I, I don't know. That's what I'm guessing. Maybe something like 20 cents a day. Maybe. Click, click. Click, click. I think that's like one of the things I was in one of my college classes was people in India going... Working like a sweatshop or factory or something and making, I don't know, 20, 30 cents a day. Maybe that. Maybe less. And they go home and their house would be literally built on a pile of garbage. So unsanitary and awful. Hey, mouse, mouse, there we go. You're making the Uru, mega Uru bucks. No idea what that word was, but something. I think I was meaning Uga. Wait, not Uga. What word was I thinking of? Mega, maybe? No. Uku? Possibly that. I don't, I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out as time progresses. We're at 320 right now, and we need 600 for a freaking sewing machine. I hope a walker's not that much. 
Oh man, that will suck. But if it can automate the system, oh, that would be amazing as hell. Because I'm seriously getting tired of clicking. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Click, 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 click. I know, we're making a decent amount with the bonuses. But it's weird how we get bonuses for a rat running around. Like, that's not sanitary at all, having a rat in a work environment. Especially where you're making sure it's like, honestly, these, these rats could crap in the fucking packaging. And then when the child or adult gets him, he could have... I don't know, what, what kind of diseases do, rat ca do rats carry? I don't know, you could get pink eye. I don't know, I can't really think of anything anymore because rats originally like carried plagues. And smallpox and I don't know what else. I'm not a medicine major. I'm only communication major. Alright, click. Click, click. We're at 513, almost at 600 for a new fucking sewing machine. Come on. There we go. We're rolling in this money. There we go. We got 600. Can you, sir, get a sewing machine? Yeah, I have no idea what a sewing machine does here. <laughs> it does... It's stupid though, how like, I don't know. You can't really tell that it's like increasing the speed at all, but I am pretty sure it is. Hey, and the next one's worker two. A thousand bucks, are you serious? Jeez. All right, let's buy a desk. Worker, desk. Worker. Alright. We're increasing our. I'm drawing a blank. Drawing a serious fucking blank. We're increasing our staff. That's what it was. <laughs> Bring in some more workers to increase our productivity. Making some big money now. All about the money, money, money. Cha ching, cha ching. It's all about the ba bling, ba bling. All right, click, click, click. But I seriously can't wait to get Walker because I hope that's what he does is just walk around. So you need fifteen thousand to fucking reset the game. That seems stupid. I think it's just to like increase the price of stuff. I don't know. Click, 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 click. I know, we're, we're making an okay amount of money right now, right? Alright, guys? <laughs> Just an okay amount. I keep on forgetting that there's people over here. I know that's just awful to say, but it's the truth. <laughs> I don't see him with my peripheral vision. Like, wait, what? There's, there's someone over there? It's probably because there's no light there. Like, there's someone in the light. I could definitely tell that there was people over there, but... Yeah, not right now. <laughs> huh. There we go. More people. We're definitely making all the money now. Hmm. So there's a cheat code to just like give yourself like more money or something. I don't know. I don't know. Are there really are cheat codes really used in games anymore? 
Seems like they just got rid of those because people can just mod or hack in shit. Jeez, there's a lot of shirts. <laughs> We're making the ultimate sweatshop here. It's still fetching the data, are you serious? My god. Alright, get you a platform, you a platform. You can't have a platform yet because we don't have enough money. Alright, let's go up here. Desk, desk, not enough. Come on, bonus, yep, there we go. Here we go, boys. We are making us some money. Another worker. Another worker. Very good, very good. Man, we're getting a lot of people in here. I wonder what the worker 2 does. Hmm. More if he works faster or if it's... Or there's two workers, maybe? I, 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 I don't know. At this point, I truly don't know what to expect from this game. It, this is one of those weird games where it's where it's fun, interesting concept, but I, I just don't know anymore. Was it worth eighty-four cents? Yeah, I'd, I'd say so. It's, I don't know. It's provided me like. Almost 30 minutes of entertainment just by clicking. So, yeah, I'd probably say it'd be worth 84 cents. But would I go out and spend, like, fucking, like, $10 on this? No. Hell no. But as far as an indie game goes, yeah, this, this game's been fun. Weird game. Fun. Seriously driving me nuts now because there's no person walking around to collect the stuff but yeah you have to unlock that get you some materials hey I got another achievement materials awesome oh yeah you guys couldn't see that because I'm just recording this game not the not everything going on on this monitor keep forgetting that Damn, there's a lot cooking. All right. So, I'm going to leave it here. Hope you guys did enjoy. If so, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for future indie games and other games that I will be uh, recording and uploading for you guys to see. Especially stay tuned in early August when No Man's Sky comes out. Because I'm going to plan on recording and also streaming a shit ton of that game because I've been ready for the game to come out for a couple weeks, well since it was first released I mean not first release but first announced just because the concept seemed awesome so I'm yeah so uh yeah I'm going to be streaming it uploading videos that kind of stuff over No Man's Sky on August 9th and 10th and so on so yeah I will see you guys next time